no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupid That's right. I gotta do ten dodges, by the way. I missed. <laughs> Dodge it, bruh. Go. Don't kill this one. I'm busy doing dodges. How many dodges is that? How many dodges is that? Where am, where's the quests? Right here. Uh, seven. Okay. What is this? I didn't get that one. Find me himself. One more, I think. Boom! Ba! Boom! What happened? Boom! Did I do that other quest, I wonder? One second. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. Alright. One second, ma'am. Gonna make sure I did this quest. Oh, I'm gonna be ah, quest. I did. She's gonna teach me a spell now. Nice. Okay. Oh ho ho, get burned alive. Anyway. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Mm hmm Are you alright? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. No problem. Can you tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. Okay. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Okay. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? Mm -hmm. The very same. Mm -hmm. Merlin Sword in the stone. Us, you know. And I'm studying some That's Merlin. curious fixtures he left here. Or Marlin. I don't know. Ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them, all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow slip. Pretty sure his name in the movie was Marlin. Fond of puzzles and enigmas. And Sword in the Stone. I don't think you like being called Merlin. Mm. I'm not sure old vine-covered pillars are worth studying. Well, I think anything concerning Merlin is worth pursuing, and mm -hmm. I shall have you know, no one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. Oh, yeah? I suspect that Mallow Suite is an important component in getting the trials to work. Ah, sweet. yeah. First I can buy that, actually. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. Mm -hmm. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Okay. I, I will do that. 
full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Nice. Chock full, you say? I'm gonna expect like five. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. Nice. I have the Mallow Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here. Yeah. Where is a stone swell on the ground? Yeah. The trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swell. And we'll see what happens. Okay. Bump. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared. True. What should I do now? Bump. Hmm. The flames make a pyre sink. Yep. I am curious about these pyres. Okay. Now we're gonna just play the waiting game. Oh. Yep. Yeah, do it again. I got it. I got it. Not so tricky after all. Nope. Easy as hell. Ooh. True. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade, should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. There is a person out here. Primrock's loyalists would go this far. Oh yeah, how far? Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. Yeah? You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. Oh. I thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock hmm. has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. Not the paintings. Keep an eye out for them. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your cards. Mm -hmm. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here. Just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I'm gonna assume that's a dungeon, maybe? Cards to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be. I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. Okay. Do I get more health? Like, how do I get more health, you know? Like, is there, a way to, is there a way to upgrade my health bar? That's what I'm trying to ask. I would like to know. If there is. Okay. Hmm. What happened? What, what, what happened to that guy? Oh my god. What do you have in store for me this time? No one here. How many of you are there? Uh oh. How nice of you. Um. 
Is that a freaking meteor I just did? Oh my god, hello. Okay, let's just calm down, sir. Oh my god. Goblins are no joke. Ow. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Ow. I died. <laughs> need to make bigger potions too. There's so many things I gotta do. Bop. Where'd he go? Where, where'd he go? Oh. You fell, sir. Help, I've fallen and I can't get up. Oh my god, what happened? That was quite something. True. Take some green shiz, Nan. Word. Uh, what does it want me to do? Come here, balls. There we go. Okay. Oh, that's what you're talking about. Okay. 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 There you go. On your way. The cards are returning to arm. Come with me, balls. Hold up. The cart needs to go. Cart's stuck. There we go. Uh, right here. Okay, okay. Let's go, come with me. Up you go. There we go. True, easy game. Yo, got your stuff back. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called True. me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. No problem. Any time. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. True. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Mm -hmm. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Uh... All that is good between us. Fine. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you. Again. I don't want to break his heart. He's, 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 he's going. He's happy. He's extremely happy. He wants to do a painting. You know, we're in Slytherin, but like... All the, best to you. Once my car the only real asshole in Slytherin is Malfoy, okay? Like, everybody else kind of has a heart to some degree. What's up, bruv? During the day. I gotta go out and come back in. Okay, we're doing this whole process. This is now a process. Whole process. There we go. Spell casting requires a oh my god, okay. And a steady wand. True. Oh no! Haha! -ha. One time every time. Almost messed that up. <laughs> Experiamus. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Uh, sure, why not? Let's see. Tea? 
Gonna need these other hop bars soon, just so you know. Where is it? Where'd it go? Oh, right here. Uh. Okay. You know, they do not carry a weapon. Ooh. Okay. Boom. Bah. All right. Nice. We're going places today, boys. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. Okay. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class, Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? Uh, very well. I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Okay. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You first. Ah, you f oh no, you didn't. I lied. It's always gonna go to the same spot no matter what. Somehow. Physics don't apply to that ball. <laughs> Let me get this one first, actually. Oh. There we go. Wait, did I still score? Nobody scores. That's right, get wrecked. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My uh, my wand slipped. True, sure, yeah. Ten points, you suck. Fifty. So you do it right there. True. Pretty sure. Yeah, I don't even need to try. I just have to get past 10. I win. I'll let you have that one. True, thanks. You beat me. I did. You suck. Get wrecked. I know all about this game. That's right. Bit of good luck. That's all. Uh huh, sure. Uh, I'm not lucky. I'm simply better than you. Yep. All right, fine. You're right. You're better than me. Thank you. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. Thank you. I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. Damn. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. That's also fair. Leander, there's no easy way to say this. Well, actually, there is. You're not cut out for it. Well, you could have found a harder way to say it. <laughs> but perhaps you're right. I'll let the others know you're good enough for them. Thank you. <laughs> I love Slytherin House. I can fucking trash talk literally everything and everyone. Collect. About the book you found. Is it, miss is it missing something? Speak out in the open. Rope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. Take care of knowing about this. Uh, Scrope. Who is Scrope? That's the wrong thing, bro. Like, what are you doing? Put it down. Put it down. You want this thing. Okay. Thank you. And for the pumpkins. Maybe I'll, uh, okay. Pumpkins? Ah, I think I know just the place. Hmm. Oh. By the broken docks. Down to the water's edge. Hmm. This had better not be a trick. What's up? Scrope. Thank you for coming all this way. No problem. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. Okay. Been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Okay. Your notes mention the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Okay. Undermining the headmaster and getting something in return. Continue. 
True. Stroke does not intend to undermine the headmaster. In fact, Strope wants to surprise him. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Oh. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm oh. sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Uh, Scrope Forbid. continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. Okay. It seems this may help us both. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Okay. Wait right here for you. The best of luck finding your pages. In the ring. Okay. All right. Okay. What is this? Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Piece of toast. What in the hell? Oh. Okay. Investigate the grotto. Black journal. Could it be? A visitor? Who the hell are you? You are not a headless Nick, just saying. <laughs> ah. What's up? The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just okay. like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. Ah. <clears throat> I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, Perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happens next. Here's an idea. Why don't you True. meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest and I'll show you where to find the pages. Uh, why the toast? Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. That's fair. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Sweet. Capitated skeleton, you say? Search. Okay. A map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Okay. Turn to Scrope. All right. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw. Who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for? Phew, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. 
Scrub shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Ah, Scrub takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Okay. Oh, bye. Okay, all right. Scrope's last hope. Okay. Now what? Whisper the password. Oh. Intramuros. Oh. Best to get the cave where Jack Daw died. This is, I'm pretty sure, a dungeon, it looks like. No. Nuh uh. Bye. True. Fine, thanks. No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Rue. Let's see where Jack Doris led me. I'm pretty sure this is the dungeon. It looks like a dungeon. Let's just go in and see. This is a dungeon. <laughs> Alright. Uh, oh, what the hell is this? What happened? Oh, okay. Okay. I wonder how big this place is. Good question. Looks like this way. The bridge, it's almost complete. Ah, here we go. Oh. There we go, easy peasy. Oh, that is, those are two huge spiders right there. What in the world? Ow, that's cheating. There's three. Okay, one down. Can't do that. Okay. Missed. Bye. Yeah, you don't like fire, do you? Ow. I actually didn't even see that guy. Okay, okay. Ooh, get this guy out of here. There we go. Get him out of here. Get squashed like a bug. That's the wrong guy, dude. That's the wrong guy, dude. Get wrecked. They just keep coming back, though. That's the problem. I gotta kill this guy. Shit. Incendio. 
There we go. Bye, Zs. Okay. That is crazy. That was insane. Hard difficulty, not easy. You have to actually find weaknesses in the mobs. You can't just pelt them with your M1 attacks. It's not going to work. Ah. There we go. Okay. I figured it out. I'm a genius. Just so you know. Good day, genius. Thank you. Oh, my God. Okay. That looks interesting as hell. All right, let's go. Yep. It's probably right here. Oh, snap. Pages safe all these years. That sucks. <laughs> the map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Yep. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? It looks like it. Ancient defenders. Okay. That actually sucks. You got pelted twice in the neck. Ow. Boom. What if I should put on a... Uh, this spell as well. There we go. He didn't like that. He didn't like that at all. He's like, what do I do? Oh my god. He just took my thing. <laughs> Pop. Uh-oh. Oh, I think we're dead. I think we're dead here. There's no possible way. What if I do this? He took my sword. What do I do? Not that. Anything but that. Can't do that. Can't do that either. I gotta do a spare Yamas. It just works so much better if I do this. What up, sir? Goodbye, sir. Bop. There you go. Have the sword you so much crave. There we go. I'm going to take all this. This is all mine. Thank you. Thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. The focus on this guy. The focus on this guy. There it goes. Holy crap. Holy crap. That didn't work. That didn't work either. Oop. I can't wait for talents where I can actually probably do more stuff. Oh, I'm taking this. Boom. Oh my god. Just just absolutely destroyed. Easiest game in my life. True, true, true. Hello? 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 Uh, yeah, I agree. This is not good. Oh, maybe this isn't a dungeon. Am I? It's like a teaser of a dungeon, maybe. Oh, no. the room's starting to flood. It is. Now what? Okay. What sort of magic is this? This must be a safety thing. Definitely a safety thing. I can only hope uh, this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. As a fair assessment. What is this yep. place? This looks like a boss battle.
It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Oh, I have talents now. Nice. Hell yeah. Spells, dark arts, core, stealth, room of requirements. Now nah, we're doing dark arts. I think dark arts is dope. That's what we're doing. Okay, I got a whole bunch in core though because I actually need these. So I'm taking all of those. Oh. The place where I said I shouldn't probably be. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I'm back at Hogwarts. Yep, yes you are. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I don't know. Ooh. Thank you. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Mm-hmm. There's a key. There's a key. I wonder if I have to do all these keys still. That would suck. Got it. <clears throat> I'm so good at that. You don't even know. Flying class. Flying class. Holy moly. Begin quest. Let's grab a broom and we shall get started. All right. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Hey. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up, firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. Up. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. No problem, I got that. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. Well, this will take some getting used to. school property. 
I want them returned in one piece. Okay. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Okay. This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. Okay. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! True! Have a good time. I've got this. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing Oop, the lake the anyway. first year. That's true, yeah. That's fair. The first years get to cross it on a boat, I guess? Interesting. I did not know that. Well, like, I knew, but I didn't think that was, ha that was like, for everybody. I thought that was just Whoa. a special thing. Once in a while. Once in a while, yeah. Some twice now. Okay, bye. Okay. Made it. Oh, did anyone else see that? Okay. Have a moment. Uh, no, no, I don't. Get out of here. <laughs> I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. Mm -hmm. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. Like? But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. That's nice. I'm suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class. Uh, I like the sound of that. Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Okay. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right okay. Now we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Rue. I just want to say that I can't look up or down. I can only look side and side. And it's actually kind of annoying. How am I supposed to follow someone if I can't look up and down? The Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. It's like you can turn by looking. You should be able to go up and down by also looking. I'm just going to put that out there. But anyway. For a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now that's more like it. There we go. Griff. Nope. I don't even know what that is. Yeah, you have to be able to look up and down. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. True. And the That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? True. Tips and jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. There's a whistle, I think. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Okay. Looks like she's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Dismount here. I don't know how. Oh, I got it. There we go. Yeah, you should be able to just control where the broom goes when you use your mouse. Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying.
Sorry about that business with Kagawa. Nah, who cares? It's just points. Doesn't really matter. Uh, I have no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. True. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps after purchase. A broom. <sighs> yeah. If yeah. You, can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Okay. I'm gonna go get a broom, I guess. Flying class quest complete. Complete main quest, challenge quest, complete main quest. Okay. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. Damn. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Yes. Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Okay. Take a look. That's quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. Mm -hmm. What are we looking for today? It's only 600 bucks. Pfft, what is this? I have a random night helmet. Uh, we're going to stop right here because I wanted to go to like the main quest. I wanted to do like the main quest. But I have to do all these other secondary ones still. Okay. So, okay. Yeah, I want to do the quest that would like take me back into my common room area, but that's just not gonna happen. So it's going on. It's going on almost five hours. So we're gonna stop right here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I might just live stream this in the future because having to edit these and then render them takes like three hours, four hours, depends on the video. And then putting them up up on YouTube takes another three hours, four hours. So I'm going to just put it on YouTube by live streaming. Uh, I'm not sure yet. We'll see how it goes. But I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.